Welcome my friends of the interwebs. I just got done doing a video uh, for P226 Nut. Um, and I thought, well, hell, while I'm, while I am here, <laughs> I'll just go ahead and uh, do another one real quick. I've been meaning to do this for a couple of days, actually. This is going to be an update vid video on my, uh, iPhone 5 experience. Um, when I first got this, I told you all that I would keep you up to date as far as what, how I liked it and, and things. And it's been a great phone. Um, except, <laughs> except I've used it to make some videos and, um, which I do. I, I like making videos with it. You know, it's it's kind of convenient. So, and I'm yeah, I've been playing with some different stuff. But anyway, I went to um, I went to retrieve the video off of this device. And when you do that, you plug you basically plug in the data cable to the bottom. Uh, it's a male female situation. Um, and then you of course put this into your computer. That's right. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward, something we've all done a million times. Um, and then, you know, of course, your computer will recognize it as a storage device. And then you can transfer the files from that storage device over to your PC. And you can then upload them to YouTube or do whatever you want to do with them. So, <laughs> the other day, I had a bunch of videos on this. And I uploaded, or tried to, attempted to. Uh, I, I, I plugged this into my computer, uh, my my desktop and I went to uh, upload well it didn't recognize this as a uh, as a device it didn't recognize it as anything in fact it was like what well, was like it didn't plug anything in um, I did get the beep and it was charging the phone okay because you can actually charge oops you can actually charge your iPhone uh, through your uh, USB uh, so I knew you know I well at least I thought that well the USB is working you know, the, so I thought, well, you know, maybe it's, uh, maybe I did something. So <laughs> I unplugged it and went over to my lap, one of my laptops. I've got a couple laptops and I plugged it into uh, my laptop. Same thing. It beeped. Uh, it was charging the phone, but it wasn't recognizing the device at all. So, okay. Then I realized that, you know, I, it wasn't my computers because, you know, actually I did this three different computers. It wasn't the computers. And I didn't think it was the cable because it was charging the device. So then I thought, shit, I got a freaking problem with the phone. And I mean, you know, I assumed it was something that I had done, <laughs> you know, something. Good. So off to the, uh, you know, off to uh, AT&T. So I go into AT&T and I say, look, you know, I got a problem. I did not take my cable with me, though. I said, look, I got a problem. I said, uh, I can't retrieve the videos off of this phone via the cable. I said something's wrong and I told him a story that basically I've just told you so the guy takes my phone and he looks at it and he goes okay he goes uh, let me see and he, he pulls his own cable out he plugs it in and sure enough it recognizes this device and he showed me right on the screen he goes see it's it's showing that the device is connected I said oh boy and he goes well he goes the good news is it's not your phone the bad news is, it's your cable, and you just said you didn't have it with you. <laughs> he said, you got a year warranty. He goes, bring the cable in. So I'm going to do that tomorrow. He goes, bring the cable in, and we will replace it. And I said to him, well, how can it be the cable? Because it does beep, and it does start charging the phone. He said, the pins on the cable, okay, I don't know if you can see that or not, but he said, the pins on the cable, a uh, couple of them do the charging, and a couple of them do the, the uh, data transfer. He said, so it's not uncommon for the ones that do the data transfer to get jacked up. And I said, oh, okay. He said it happens all the time. <laughs> all the time. I didn't know that. Uh, so that's a little something that Apple needs to get worked out uh, because that's a real pain in the ass. They're, these cables are not really expensive, but it's still 20 bucks. Um, now, you know, you get a new one for a year, but I mean, this phone is not that old. So, is this one of those things where if you're going to be doing a lot of data transferring, you're going to have to buy, you know, two or three cables a year? Or four cables a year? I don't know. Let me know if you've uh, used uh, uh, your iPhone. Now, this is the iPhone 5, so you get the smaller um, thing on it. Let me know how much, if you've had any issues with your data cables, with your Apple products. This is the first Apple product that I've ever had, so, I mean, I don't know. Um, I don't have a lot of experience with using phones to do video. I did, I think, maybe one or two videos for my Droid. Um, the whole time I've, I've used it, I've done a lot of videos with this. 
So just, yeah, let me know what you guys think about that. So anyway, that's a little update. Um, it's interesting because I didn't really expect that I would have anything negative to say about the iPhone 5, other than things I've already said, like I'm really not a big fan of the fact that it only records audio in, in uh, mono. That kind of blows. Outside of that, though, I don't really have any major bitches about this phone. It's been a really good phone. Everything on it works the way it's supposed to work, except for that. Anyway, that's all I got for you guys. Everybody take care. See ya!